Hey everybody, hope you guys are having a great and blessed day. Just want to get my vlog started here. Uh, just got done putting some wax in my wax warmers here. I put humidor in this one, which is the tobacco one, a tobacco smell. And then in this one over here, I put patchouli. I don't know if you guys can see that on camera here. So yeah, I think that'll be an interesting combination. It might smell good together, so I'm giving it a try. Again, tobacco and patchouli together, so we'll see how that smells here in a little while. So it's currently 11.25 a.m. and my phone currently says it's 86 degrees Fahrenheit, so it's definitely warming up today. Just wanted to show you guys some of my plants here. Uh, the cactuses are doing good, cacti, whatever you want to call it. Uh, looks like they're doing pretty good. And of course the one over here that I got from Walmart a while back. Wanted to show you guys my uh, mom repainted this old bench here that we've had forever. Uh, she painted it green and white. I think it looks pretty good. She's a really crafty person. Yeah, these flowers are beautiful right here. I love this. The aloe vera is looking really, really good. Uh, there's still a couple brown spots yet, but other than that, it is really greened up because it was looking really sad when I had it inside. Uh, but yeah, it's done really well so far out here. I need to get that thing. I think it's called a trellis or something like that. Uh, my mom mentioned it to me, but for my vines here so they can start to climb up the, the shop here. But yeah, they're definitely growing and I'm looking forward to it. And hopefully they keep on growing. Hey, you guys know the lavenders just went crazy this year. It's just growing and growing, but these flowers have really taken off here in the last week or so. Uh, a lot of them have bloomed. Uh, there's still some yet to bloom, I'm sure, but just beautiful flowers here. I'm just loving it. Here's my palm tree. Got these right here. There's some of my mom's plants here in this this garden area these are bloomed here hey everybody i'm just uh snacking on some cucumber here uh put some salt and pepper on top this is gonna sound kind of funny so i think cucumber kind of tastes like watermelon but unsweet watermelon what a weird analogy but i don't know i was just eating some cucumber yesterday and i just came up with that with that thought in my head, I was like, hmm, cucumber is basically unsweetened watermelon. But I will say, this cucumber is really, really good, especially with the pepper on it. Hmm. Comment down below. <coughs> pepper <laughs> got to me. <coughs> Excuse me. Comment down below. Do you like to put pepper on your food? Hey everybody, for lunch here, I'm having a classic peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Uh, grape jelly. And then uh, just some chips. Hey everybody, I wanted to show you this. This is really good. Uh, these are the chips that I'm having for lunch. They're Garden Salsa Sun Chips. Yeah, I really enjoyed my lunch. My uh, peanut butter and jelly sandwich and of course the Garden Salsa Sun Chips. But I just came back in here in my tiny house. And so far this smells like a pretty good combination. Uh, I think it smells great. The patchouli and the humidor tobacco wax melt. Hey everybody, uh, just woke up from a nap, uh, I was just watching YouTube while I was laying here in my bed and yep, that was the end of that story, uh, I think I slept a little bit over half an hour, about probably 37 minutes, somewhere in there, uh, but yeah, I did not expect to take a nap, but I went ahead and took one anyway, <laughs> so just wanted to get you guys up to date. Hey everybody, uh, as you know, I just woke up from a nap. I'm still lagging a little bit, so I think I'm going to do something that will wake me up immediately. I don't Good afternoon. Yeah, the pool feels really nice, but uh, probably won't stay in for long. My dad said the UV rays are really high, probably. He said his skin feels like it's burning, 
but yeah it does seem like the uv rays are pretty high so it's uh definitely summertime <laughs> My phone says it's currently 93 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, didn't take long to dry off outside at all. Uh, as you can see, I'm back in my regular clothes, but it was nice to get in the pool for a second and cool off on this pretty hot, pretty hot summer day with the sun just beating down. Uh, it's very, very, very hot out. I'm gonna reapply my uh, scent of the day fragrance here. Gotta switch hands here. Get creative. There we go. A couple more sprays. There we go. Mmm, nice and fresh. Nice uplifting smell. Love it. Perfect for this really, really hot day. So my dad was pretty much right on the UV rays. I looked at my phone on the weather thing. The UV rays is at the top of the graph chart and it says very very high so whew, yeah that sun is something else today yeah one of my good friends tc uh put me onto this this is called chili mac and it is very very good had it for dinner last night actually had it for breakfast today and yeah i think chili mac is excellent i highly recommend trying it if you've never had it Hey everybody, uh, my friend TC and I came out here to Walmart. Uh, we're just gonna check it out and hang out here for a little bit. Hey everybody, just looking at the fragrances here at Walmart. I've tried quite a bit of these. There's a few that I haven't tried yet, but I've tried quite a bit. And of course, I love my Nautica Voyage. Love it, love it. I actually think Dossier is a pretty good brand. Uh, they make pretty good dupes of very high-end fragrances. Uh, some of them are really, really good inspirations or dupes, whatever you want to call it. Hey everybody, we're just looking at some of the manga here at Walmart. Uh, TC just picked up this book, it's Berserk. But, uh, I said book, I meant manga, excuse me. But, uh, yeah, they have a few. I don't see any One Piece, though. Look at this, Star Wars manga coloring book. Star Wars drawn in manga doesn't even look like Star Wars. It doesn't even look like Han Solo, man. No. That Luffy figure is so inspirational. Look yeah, at Luffy, man. It's weird, though. It doesn't even look like... It's like a Homer Simpson kind of like, smile. It does? Homer Simpson smile? Like it it kind of has like the eyeballs and the... Yeah, they didn't do the best job on that model. Look, 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 look. look at his eyes. And yeah. there's a big difference between that. Yeah. And they're charging... $10 for these. No, no, no. Yeah. I don't think it's 10 I think it's 32 So yeah guys, we did check the price. It is $32.96 for Luffy figure. This is really, really cool. I actually, I'm not a big movie person, but I love the movie Coraline. It was a great, great movie. And uh, just a replica of the, the doll that she had in the movie. It's my new backyard patio. I got a grill, I got this table, got some chairs. Just gonna enjoy this. Just imagining I'm grilling some filet mignon steaks right now. Yeah, TC and I are over here looking at the men's body soaps. I have never heard Old Spice do some of these. I've never heard I've of heard some of these. Things. This is news yeah, thing. I've never heard of these. Never heard of Raptor Strike, Alpha Centauri, Dragon Blast, Shark Hammer. Heard of Mamba King. Heard of Cranking Guard. Heard of Bear Glove, but I never heard of some of these. Of course, Fiji is really, really good. And uh, of course, Swagger. Can't forget Swagger. You know, I will say, men's body wash and really self-care items have came so far. I'm very, very surprised. As much as I love Dr. Squatch, I really, really do. But I wish their bar soaps would last longer. I want them to make a liquid form of their soap because their soap smells really, really good. And it's not, uh, not too bad on my skin, personally. Of course, everybody's different. But yeah, they just don't last long enough. So I switch back and forth between... Dr. Squatch and Native as my main brands to uh, when I take a shower. As of right now, this is the body wash that I currently have. Citrus and Herbal Musk. I think it smells really good for the hot summer. 
Hey everybody, I blind bought two fragrances in Walmart. Uh, I've been wanting this one for a while. I've seen a lot of reviews on it. Uh, this is Burberry Touch for men. It smells pretty good. It smells clean. I haven't read any of the notes or anything. And then I also got, since I love Nautica Voyage, love it, love it, love it, I got Nautica Midnight Voyage. The bottle is a little darker than the OG, and the cap is also like this reflective blue. And man, first sniff, it smells really, really good. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed that clip. I think TC and I are going to run to McDonald's and grab a bite to eat. We're both kind of hungry. It's currently... 10 30 p.m. and a lot of uh, places to eat here in Woodward close at like either 9 or 10 it just depends but I think McDonald's is still open I think McDonald's Brahms and of course the gas station uh, or truck stop I'm not sure it's Domino's out there by our movie theaters I think they're open late really really late or they're open 24 7 I don't remember so don't quote me on that but yeah pretty much past 9, 10 o'clock here in Woodward, Oklahoma. There's not much open. Even Walmart, our Walmart, closes at 11 p.m. And as you guys seen, we just got out of there. Uh, so TC had to grab something really quick at his apartment, so we stopped back, stopped back by here real quick. So he's uh, grabbing whatever he needs, and then we're going to go to uh, McDonald's and grab a bite to eat, I think. Just wanted to, just wanted to get you an update. All right, what are we getting, boys? Uh, tell, but, them, tell them that they still do those hamburger bundles. You guys uh, still do those uh, $12 bundle deals? Yes, sir. Uh, can we get one of those? Any the chicken McNugget bundle, please. Oh, my bad. Wait, what do you want? Oh, that, there it is, tweet. I think so. Right. Uh, can we get, what's what sauce? Uh, barbecue and sweet sour. Uh, barbecue and sweet and sour, please. John, is there anything you want? The blue Fanta. Oh. Uh, is that whole bag thing for all three of those? Ask, or, ask, or am I getting ask, something different? Ask him. Ask, ask him what? Ask the dude if, if what comes in the bundle cheeseburger bundle. Two cheeseburgers, 20 piece nugget, two fries. What else? Um, can I get a, a, a 2B with medium fries? Uh, 2B with medium fries. And a, um, a medium Fanta Blue Raspberry Frosty. And a medium Fanta Blue Raspberry Slash. Uh, <laughs> you want the mix? Yes. Can I have? Can I also have the medium blue Fanta Blueberry? Can I get another one of those? Yes. No. Yep. That's yeah. It. Just a drink. That's all. Thank you, sir. That's not bad. Oh, that's not too bad. That's actually not too bad. That was a chaotic order. <laughs> we did not know what we wanted. I just woke up. John just woke up. By the way, John's with us. I got off at 9. Got off at 9. Bro said he was getting off early today. He's like, yeah, we can hang out. And then he ends up getting off at 9 p.m. Everybody just left the mechanic, so I wasn't going to leave him hanging. Yeah. John's a good dude, man. So inspirational. But alrighty, we'll catch up with you guys when we get the food. <coughs> food. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. You too. Well, we got our food. So, oops, sorry, John. My silly self forgot a drink, so I'm over here at Brahms. They close at like 10:50. It's 10:45. It actually tastes a lot better. That's not that bad. It actually tastes a lot better. That's an odd time to close. 10 .50. Yeah, 11, 10:50. Uh, yes, ma'am. Can I please get a large Sprite? Uh, that's it. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. <laughs> my voice, bro. Why does my voice crack at the worst times? You're welcome. <laughs> bro, my voice cracks so bad all the time. At least you got it on video. Yeah, it's all good. <laughs> the subscribers will get a laugh out of it. Here you go. Have a lovely evening. Thank you. You have a lovely evening as well. McDonald's first.
No. <laughs> <laughs> McDonald's he first. He didn't like that. He smelled, he smelled McDonald's at this point. McDonald's first. No, there's my clickbait. That is inspirational. I did not expect that. I love vlogging. You never know. You never know what's going to happen when vlogging. There's my clickbait. Hey, everybody. I just want to wrap up my video here. Uh, we're eating our food here. I got my Sprite from McDonald's, or excuse me, got my Sprite from Brahms. Blooper. But uh, I'm gonna wrap up my video here. I wanna get it uploaded before midnight, so we're gonna enjoy our food. Look at John, so inspirational. <laughs> but God bless you guys. Peace be with you.